So it's Money in the Bank weekend, Santos Escobar, and thank you for joining us. Um, you are in the Money in the Bank. Um, how are you feeling going into this match? Are you quite confident that you might become the victor? Yes, I'm confident. I'm energized. I'm motivated. I'm happy. I'm ready. And you look great. Thank you, you so much. I, I try. I try. The, the, the London is a, is a city that I love, that I adore, that I respect. London audiences are educated audiences. Absolutely. The reason why I'm saying this is because you don't just march into London and expect people to cheer for you. Accustomed to the West End productions, accustomed to the good shows, London audiences will cheer and applaud who they deem Absolutely. earned that Absolutely. honor. Absolutely. City of queens and kings a royal you feel you feel that royal air everywhere you walk why wouldn't i dress like this you know i was gonna say we see that in you as well like as soon as you've come up from the ranks of nxt you held yourself with some sort of pristine you, you you walk a certain beat you're great in the ring um so we're rooting for you you don't be surprised if you hear some chance tomorrow that's, that's, that's all i'm saying that's don't what i'm surprised. expecting but yeah. but again I'm willing to go out there and earn that respect right. and earn that applause. Right. Right. And, and, and to your point, you are who you represent. Yeah. Yeah. So every single time I go out there, I know people is thinking of where I come from, my legacy, my culture, my country. Yeah. So I have to look my best part, and act my best. Well, let's talk about your heritage and your country and your culture. Mexican wrestling is like seen as one of the best when it comes to the historical uh, moment of wrestling, moving that, that sport forward. Mexican wrestling is a big pillar in that community, you know, CML, AAA, uh, your uncle, your father. Um, you know, we had a great moment where WWE sent a love letter to Puerto Rico. When are we going to see that for Mexico? Because I feel Mexico is a huge big part of what we all love as wrestling. Hopefully Triple H will yeah. see this interview and I mean, the LWO evolved into a movement. Yeah. It's not just about Latinos, Latinos, Latinos. I, I believe that if you're an underdog in life, if you wake up every single day with the burning desire to succeed and overcome obstacles, LWO represents you because that's who we are. Uh, natural born underdogs, overachievers, you know, achieve everything in life, earn every step of the way. That's what LWA is and how crazy and wild it is that we have London World Order shirts. Yeah. What does yeah. that have to do with Latino? Well, everything, everything. Because we have this greed, this will, this determination, this never ending fire and desire to be someone at whatever it is that we do. And that, that touches people's minds and hearts people identify themselves with that yeah. Yeah, if, if we can put a smile on people's faces fine but if we can inspire someone to take a step that maybe they didn't want to take to do something that maybe they didn't want to do then we already won well i hope well i know tomorrow you're gonna go and kill it and, and we're gonna we're gonna be there rooting for you so thank you for your time Santos. i really appreciate that thank okay. you my friend